The trailer park closed down, I think it was in 1960, and everyone had to move, and they moved the trailer park on the west side of town. So at that time, all my relatives and my friends and everybody had to leave the trailer park. So they closed it down. But anyway, here's some photographs of what it was like. This was our front yard. In the, and in the middle of the area, they had <laughs> clotheslines. <laughs> I mean, these are really great pictures, but <laughs> it gives you an idea of what it was like. Very good. This is my, um, this was my shop teacher, Mr. Rose and his little girl. So they all, they lived there. Um, this is a picture of the bathhouse. There's one over on the left side. Some of these were my little friends. And again, you can see um, what it was like. I don't know if you want to take pictures of all these or you can scan them. In all these little pictures, I never had my hair combed. I mean, I was just always a tomboy, huh? So my mom used to tell me full of vim and vinegar. I was always playing. We were playing in the backyard. We'd play cowboys. And I remember one time we'd play with our bicycles. We'd turn them upside down and play with the wheels like we were going down the river. Tarzan, I guess we were doing Tarzan. We're going down the river. We never saw any rivers, but... Oh, and then I made my first communion up in, in Los Alamos. Um, I made my first communion at um, Immaculate Heart of Mary Church. However, in, <laughs> none of the photographs we took at the church, they're all in, you could see the snow. We were all in our yards. And the other thing about the trailer park is they had these, they were called sheds or something. They were kind of like an extra bedroom where you could sheetrock them and make an extra bedroom or a sewing room. Kind of looked like that. You could kind of, you could kind of customize your own lot. And my grandpa lived in the shed. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he had his bedroom there. But this is a picture of the trailer, the front yard. And I think that's midnight in there. And here's a here's a street scene. And these are my little friends, I think. This was Peaches and Alice. <laughs> and Peaches' family, or her dad, used to own the dry cleaning business. And my little friend Alice, her mom, used to be the cook at the American Legion. I think so, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And these are school pictures. And this is a picture of Canyon Elementary School. And this is Mrs. Warren, which is our second grade teacher. And my friend Sally Ber Berkheimer. And my little friend Alice. And here's me in front of the school.
This was 1957. And this was when I was in kindergarten, 1955. My mom combed my hair, but I had cut my own bangs <laughs> for school pictures. <laughs> She tried to comb my hair. I was a, I was a terror, huh? <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> um, some of these are family. This was a picture of my grandmother, who lived, my grandmother and grandfather on my father's side lived two trailers down. And this is a picture of my mom and my dad. This was the back backyard of the trailer court, and we had a lawn, huh? We had the nicest yeah. lawn in mm -hmm. the neighborhood. Mm -hmm. We had a lawn. A lawn and a place to play and trees to climb. And this was... Probably, well, I was might have been two years old. Something like that. Pretty close. Yeah, this is a picture of my mom and dad up in Los Alamos. I was probably in one of the store parking lots. Oh, this is a nice picture of some of the apartments at that time. And this is what the interior, the living room looked like of the trailer that we lived in. Yeah, you don't want to show that one. <laughs> A picture of me and Santa Claus. And in one of the stories I tell about uh, my grandfather's 1955 Studebaker pickup truck, there's a picture of my grandpa and I in his truck. And this is Christmas. And this was a family photograph. Take it, I think I was about six years old then. Something like that. Yeah. And my dad's name was uh, Al Lucero. My mom's name is Helen. And I was Linda, Linda Joyce. <laughs>